In this video, I am going to talk about the face value and the place value of a digit. At first, I am going to talk about the face value. When you comes across the face value, we are only going to provide the value of the digit itself. It is the value of a digit itself. Let's assume we have the example as face value of 2 is 2 and another example is going to be let's assume we have the number 5 and its face value the face value of 5 is 5 so this is for this is the condition for the face value and it is quite useful if suppose there is large number of large digit of numbers let it be something like this and to represent the or to deliver to someone about this number you can actually call its face value instead of saying some lakhs or thousand words instead of words you can directly name some numbers like one two five three two six seven one and by saying that this is the face value and so now coming to the place value it is the value where we are going to multiply set a number of this set a number face value with its position value let's assume we have set a number like 2586 now you suppose I need to find out the place value for this file at that case you know it is having the face value as 5 and this 5 is multiplied with the position where it is existing like it is present at this is the unit place and this is the tenth place and this is going to be the hundredth place so to find its place value you need to multiply this face value that is 5 multiplying with this position that is going to be 100 so place value of this 5 is going to be 500 is the place value of 5 in 2 5 8 6 and this 5 is actually the face value and this is the position where this number 5 exists inside this where this 5 digit exists inside this number so this is all about this face value and this place value and uh, this face value you can directly speak like one two five three two six and so when you're delivering certain phone number or something like that and we are actually using a face value and we also know that if suppose there is a decimal now this point somewhere right here and some point we have set a number like one five three and some another random number like two five six and you know after this point we say this as two five six and before this we say this number as one hundred fifty three 
so we use certain speaking like we are speaking in terms of these digits like two five six and similarly for this face value we are actually naming its digit values 